The world is full of magic, energies, and so many possibilities. What if I told you, you can have anything you want? Yes, anything. Because with the universe, anything is possible. You are magic. Your thoughts are powerful. Your words are powerful. And what you believe is what you attract into your world. With the power of manifestation, you can create anything you want. Yes, anything you want. My shop, Jalissa's Manifestations, provides the tools to help you attract your desires, your wishes, your dreams. My candles are infused with crystals which hold energies and specific herbs to attract your manifestations. All you need is a wish and to believe. Energies are real and control your moods and what you attract. Sometimes we can feel depleted or in need of a boost of energy and that's what my spiritual baths are for. Cleansing, protecting, attracting love, abundance, and opportunities. The possibilities are endless. All you need is to believe. Believe in yourself. Believe in your dreams. Believe in the magic inside you. Just believe. Hello, Gemini. How you doing, baby? I hope you guys are good. I hope you guys are blessed. It is your girl, Jalissa, and I am coming to you guys with Gemini's love reading. Bless. All right, Gemini, let's get it. Let's go. First, I must mist with my protection mist, of course, to protect us from any negative energies, entities, or interferences. Bless. All right, let's get it. Let's go. First, I'm going to give you your angel number, and then we're going to go into the reading. Spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guides, angels, please come through and help me channel this beautiful message here today for Gemini. Spirit, what is the angel number for Gemini here today? Thank you so much. All right, Gemini, we're going to put GE for Gemini. We have four, one, two, four. Okay. 4124 is your angel number, Gemini. So go on to your search engine when you have time and put in 4124, angel number meaning, and bam, there goes your message from spirit. Bless. All right, guys, listen, if you can do share your messages, I love reading them. And also it is beneficial for the fellow viewer as everyone gets a different message. Yes. All right, so let's get into this reading. So we're going to use my music deck to get the vibe and energy out here today for us. Spirit, ancient ancestors, universe, spiritual guides, angels, please come through and help me channel this message here today for Gemini. Woo, that, okay. <laughs> for Gemini here today. Thank you so much. Bless. All right, spirit. So what's the vibe? What's the energy for this Gemini love reading here today? What does Gemini need to hear? What does Gemini need to know? I'm channeling a Ciara song, but I don't know the name of this song. I know you, na 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 na. Na 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 na. Somebody better than you. I know you. I don't know the name of that song, honestly, but I am channeling it. If anyone knows or could have picked up what that was, please write it down below. Thank you. All right, so we got Nelly featuring Kelly, Dilemma. No matter what I do, all I think about is you. Even when I'm with my boo, boy, you know I'm crazy over you. No matter what I do, all I think about is you. Even when I'm with my boo, boy, you know I'm crazy over you. Okay? That was like a hit hit. Okay, yes. And then we have boys to men, end of the road. Girl, you know we belong together. I don't have no time for you to be playing with my heart like this. You'll be mine forever, baby. You just wait. We belong together. And you know that I am right. Why do you play with my heart? Why do you play with my mind? All right, Gemini. So what I'm getting here, 
I'm getting that there right now is some sort of turbulence in love, Gemini, okay? I feel like you are in a triangle or there's some sort of interference in a connection. I see you and this person. I see you guys have feelings for each other, but there's something interfering. Could be parents, mother, father, family members, exes, or something outside the relationship is what I'm getting. That's just coming in between you and them. And it's beginning to create a block. Okay. I'm getting that. Mm hmm. There's a lot of mind games. All right. So you're left to like kind of figure things out. I'm getting mixed signals as well. So let's see. Let's see, Gemini, what it is that spirit wants you to hear. All right. Spirit, talk to me. What's the message? What does Gemini need to hear today? What does Gemini need to know? Thank you so much. This is my tarot deck under the sea which is also available on my shop. Listen, guys, I have 40% off of everything, okay? I have multiple decks, divination tools, candles, crystals, all sorts of things. You need something, baby? Go ahead and check out my shop down below and enjoy that 40% off as we are celebrating my two-year anniversary for my manifestation shop. Bless. All right, so Spirit, talk to me. What's the vibe? What's the energy for Gemini? What do they need to know? What do they need to hear? What are the messages that need to come through? Thank you so much. Yeah, that, that Sierra song is just playing in my head. I know you stopped loving me. No, 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 no. Something, something better than you. I don't even know the words. I'm just hearing like the beat. <laughs> oh man i wish i knew okay so we got the four of cups in reverse oh hi mm -hmm. there goes that third party i was talking about yeah there's gonna be change coming gemini we have the ace of swords yeah all right for a while you were disappointed bored and kind of like discontent with a situation because of a third party situation i'm getting the past a lot has happened in the past gemini okay we have the page of swords and this situation had you stuck for a minute okay kind of stuck in your own bubble mentally emotionally and what i'm seeing is that doors are about to open up ten of wands all right so this means that change is on the way i see your mind changing i also see your perspective changing seven of cups in reverse yeah like one like something that you were very confused about before i see that changing the chariot in reverse we got some cancer energies coming through okay so this could be in your chart or this could be your person's sign all right but yeah like i see your perspective on this connection changing mm -hmm. i do see that you're very overwhelmed gemini when it comes to love right now oh my gosh yes all right but that confusion you're feeling now is going to fade because i see clarity coming in all right spirit what else does gemini need to hear what else does gemini need to know thank you so much mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yeah like there's been some sort of illusion here with love and i see like that illusion is coming to a close meaning clarity is coming in no more confusion no more mystery I do see online. So I feel like you're going to see something online or you're going to get some sort of information online that's going to clear things up. I also see a door opening here for you, Gemini. Okay. Mm hmm. We have investing, dealt a bad hand, battle of the wits, family tree at last, and the fight. Okay, just so you know. Let's get a little bit more out here and then we are off because I want to give you a big picture, Gemini. I don't want you confused. I want I want to give you this clarity, even though that clarity is coming in regardless. All right. Um, I want to give you as much info as I can here. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. All right. We have can't be trusted. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. We have desire to win. Yeah, I'm getting bad timing, Gemini. Missing you.
I'm getting battles as well. All right. You're a very strong person, Gemini, and so is your person. Okay. So there is a lot of lessons being learned right now. I'm getting strong vulnerability, but not being able to show it. We got focus on yourself. We also got partying. Okay, so let's get it. Let's go. Spirit, please come through and help me channel this message here today for Gemini. Thank you so much. Bless. All right, Gemini, when it comes to love, right now there's blockages. All right, I'm seeing a big block stopping you from moving forward. Okay, this is going to eventually get out of your way. All right, this block is confusion. This block is making you feel overwhelmed. I'm getting delays. I'm getting issues. All right, issues coming towards your person, issues with your person coming towards you. I see them watching you. I'm getting social media. All right, so they could be watching your social media, your stories, your posts, keeping an eye on you, wanting to know what you're doing, Gemini. Like I said, there was some sort of third party situation here that was getting in the way of y'all connection. And what I'm seeing is that a new path is going to open up for you. I'm seeing that this clarity is going to give you peace and is also going to take you down a new direction. Your person wishes that they met you at a different time. They're telling me that the time they met you was not really the right time, okay? They feel like um your connection could definitely be bigger than what it was and what it is, and they would love to see where it can go, but unfortunately, due to the time that you guys met and the time that you guys, you know, enjoyed this connection, they feel like they were dealt a bad hand. Mm-hmm. I see that you guys both have very strong personalities and I'm getting combative energy. So it's kind of like both of your guards are up. I'm getting that there's vulnerability here where you guys both are vulnerable to each other, but you don't show each other that. I'm getting that this is a battle, battle of who's going to wear the pants in this connection. Your person wants to lead, but you want to lead as well, Gemini. So there is a problem here with vulnerability and being able to just open up and be soft and be free. Yes, you guys are connected spiritually, just so you know, okay? You come from the same soul family tree. Your cult your cultures are different, meaning that you could be from different locations, different places, different religions. I do see that. You guys have different values and beliefs and traditions, so that's where that combative energy may come from because you have different point of views and different values. And this is going to be a challenge in this connection, just so you know. There is a spiritual connection here because, like I said, you guys come from the same soul family tree. So I'm getting soulmate vibes. I'm getting twin flame vibes. I'm just getting a very strong connection here between the two. There is definitely also a lot of passion. Mm -hmm. They don't want to give you up, Gemini. Don't get it twisted. They don't want to give you up. But they feel like the timing is just horrible because of the circumstances in their life, because of what's going on in their life right now. Um, Right now, just so you know, they can't be trusted, okay? They're not really being 100% honest with you. They haven't been honest entirely with you about their life and um what they would like to come out of this relationship. They would love to see where it could go, and they would love to see how it would blossom, but for some reason, there's something in their life that is stopping them. Mm -hmm. So it's kind of like they're one foot in, one foot out. They don't want to give up, but then they know they can't stay. So it's so they're like really like, you know, confused and upset with themselves. Mm -hmm. They know you're worth it. OK, it's not about you and your worth. This has to do with them and their life. Just so you know. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. I want you to know that they're being activated right now, Gemini, okay? So internally, their internal world is being activated so that they can fight for what they want and they can overcome their fears, especially fears when it comes to love because when it comes to love, they're scared because I see that they miss you so much. They never miss anyone so much the way they miss you and they do. Mm -hmm. And they're secretly snooping around and asking friends or, you know, going online, trying to figure things out. They're investigating your life, boo-boo. They want to see what's going on with you. If you're talking to anyone new, if something new is happening or what you're doing, they want to win. They want to definitely be on top of this situation. They don't want to lose. They do definitely have a big, big ego. And what they're saying here, just so you know, not to trigger you, but I have to be honest because spirit wants you to get the message. What they're saying here is that, you know, if they can't get you back or be able to have you the way they would like you, 
then, you know, they're going to find someone that can top you just so you know that they didn't lose. Okay, they didn't get the shorter end of the stick. But you guys are learning some serious lessons here together. Lessons about vulnerability, lessons about trust, and also ego. Because what I'm seeing is that your person is in this shadow energy, okay? And these divine lessons are going to help you guys both you and them gemini it is because you're learning a lot with this person and they're learning a lot with you mm -hmm. soon sooner than later they're gonna try to be by your side okay sooner than later right now they're in their ego so it's gonna take some time for your person to kind of figure it out right now your person just like wants to be alone and wants to like have fun and wants to do them and doesn't really want to be controlled that's why they're saying like you're the perfect person at the wrong time because right now i'm not really into being in a commitment or being tied down right now i want to have fun right now i want to be out there i want to be in these streets i want to just you know enjoy my best life they're not really focused on commitment or love even though they have feelings for you even though they feel tied to you and that's this that's the block here the block is what they want to do with their life isn't really compatible to what you want in this connection all right so if you want to have a good time this is the person for you but if you want a commitment they're not ready and they're not going to be ready for a little while is what i'm getting gemini the universe wants you to focus on yourself, okay? Focus on yourself right now. Make yourself a priority. Know that an opportunity is definitely coming through. An opportunity is coming your way, Gemini. Like I said, there's a door opening where clarity is going to come through and you're going to get the answers you need. Like, like I said before, I see the confusion and I see that your person give you yeah they gave you mixed signals therefore they led you on and led you believe that more will come out of this situation because they did want more but they weren't completely sure so they sold dreams basically and very soon you're gonna get that clarity where you're gonna see it for yourself that they were selling you dreams and they were doing it because of their own agenda they wanted to have you they didn't want to lose you they didn't want to um turn you off you know they wanted to reel you in and they wanted to swindle you because they wanted you in their corner they didn't want you to leave and they don't want you to leave honestly they're definitely interested that's why they're lurking on you that's why they're on your social media platforms that's why they're talking to your friends that's why they're trying to um get as much information as possible but this is so overwhelming for you and that's why spirit is coming through to say babe listen you need to focus on yourself right now this person just isn't ready right now, all right? What's for you will not pass you. If you want to, you know, give this person another opportunity in the future, there will be an opportunity, but right now, they're not ready for it. They're not ready to give you what you need, and they're hurting too. They're missing you. They're, they're missing the connection. They're missing y'all conversations. They want to kiss you. They want to hold you. They want to hug you. But again, there's this battle here and they're not going to stand down. They want to win by any cost. And if you don't give them what they want, they're just going to, you know, basically piss you off by trying to show off someone else, you know. I see them being petty in that way. They're in their shadow, babe. They're, they're, there's a lot of growing up to do here. Mm -hmm. And it's not your fault, Gemini. So do not be upset with yourself and don't be disappointed. Because what I'm getting is that you're going to learn something major here. You're already learning a lesson here with this person. And I see it because I see the clarity coming in and I see that door opening up for you. Mm -hmm. I see new ideas coming in. I'm also getting surgery for some. So some of you guys may be getting surgery. I'm also getting that this mental clarity coming in is going to open up so many opportunities for you. Yes. And I see you letting go of the load. You're usually saying yes, 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 yes to everyone, Gemini. And what I'm getting is that you're going to start saying no, 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 no. You're going to start focusing on yourself and doing what you want, you know, instead of trying to do for others so much so where you end up with the short end of the stick. OK, so this person is literally trying to live their best life while missing you. OK, and they don't want to back down. They don't want to. um you know, give you that energy of you won, okay? Because apparently it's a battle. They're showing me a battlefield and they don't want you to feel like you won, all right? They want to feel like the winner in this situation and don't take that personal. I would just literally refocus my thoughts, babe, 
in Gemini, when it comes to love, I would refocus my thoughts and look towards the future for something new and something better because that's what's coming your way. I see something new and I see something better coming your way and I see doors opening up for you. When it comes to this person here, Gemini, just know that there's a big block for a reason. The universe is kind of, you know, blocking the, the connection for this big reason and it's because they're not ready for you. And they're not going to serve you in the right way. They're going to kind of drain your energy like a vampire, you know, an energy vampire. And they're going to emotionally deplete you. And you deserve so much better than that, Gemini. So that is why this big block is in the way, okay? And whatever is going on here with this third-party situation, it's also nothing serious, okay? Because what I'm seeing is that your person isn't taking anyone serious, all right? Your person is literally just thinking about themselves, Mm hmm. All right. So let's get messages out here. Let's see what your person wants to say. And I'm sorry to deliver this message, Gemini, for real. Um, But I'm authentic. You know, I, I like to be true and I don't play when it comes to spirit messages. Spirit has something to say. I am going to say it. All right. Because there's a reason for that. Spirit wants you to hear that so you could make a better choice for self, you know. And so that you could get that closure possibly that you may need at this moment. All right, so Spirit, talk to me. What would Gemini's person like to say right now to Gemini if they had the opportunity? I feel sometimes you're too attached. All right, so they're letting you know right then and there that they're comfortable for one. And for two, they aren't scared to lose you because they feel like you're not going to go anywhere. And like I said, this is a trigger. And um, I'm sorry for the message, but... It's what they're saying, Gemini. They feel like you're too attached. They feel like they feel very confident because you may have done a lot for them and you may have gone above and beyond for them. And that has given them that comfortability. It has given them that that confirmation that they kind of got you, you know, wrapped up in their in their tie, in their net. And they're not letting go unless, you know, you hop out of there and they can't catch you again, you know. But mm mm. I was made to love you, okay? And that's where that mixed emotion and mixed feelings come into play because they do have feelings for you. They just don't feel ready for what you have to offer. I'm selfish right now. All I'm worried about is myself, me. You see, this is confirmation, Gemini, of what I've been saying. You know, your person is literally just worried about me, 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 myself, and I. That's, that's really all that matters to them at this moment. I have been badly hurt in the past, all right? So your person has been in other relationships before you, of course. And what they want you to know is that they've been really hurt in the past. Someone crossed them, someone hurt them. And this also has a lot to do with why they're so selfish right now, with why they have like an issue being vulnerable, why it's difficult for them to open up that heart and that communication. Because when they did that in the past, they were burned, I'm making someone else my priority, okay? So this doesn't have to be romantic, but they are making someone else their priority, okay? So right now, their focus, their main focus is a different situation. Um, Let's go here. Hold on. All right, we're going to do the pendulum, and then we're going to do story time with my story dice. All right, guys, so listen. I'm going to do an extended Gemini. If you're interested... You are more than welcome to join me, okay? It's going to be juicy. So what we're going to do is that we're going to talk about this new lane opening up for you, this new path that's opening up for you, a new, brand new, beautiful opportunity where I see your energy shifting. So we're going to see what that's about and what's coming with this new door opening. And we're also going to see what's the truth, all right? Because I see truths are going to be revealed that are going to bring in clarity for you, Gemini, all right? A lot of things that your person has been hiding or keeping away from you is going to be revealed. So we're going to see what that is, all right? Along with more messages from your person, a lot more messages, and advice and guidance from the universe. That's going to be general, okay? So if you want to join me, the link is down below. I will be more than happy to be there with you okay it's gonna be juicy we're gonna play dilemma as i shuffle and lay the messages out all right so let's go spirit what else does gemini need to hear 
all right, Gemini, I see that your person, your person is going to tell you that they were tripping, okay? They're going to tell you that they want a restart. They want to do things over, and I see them coming in with some sort of gift. I see that you're going to be at the fork of the road where you're like, I don't know what I want to do. Um, you're going to actually plant a new seed, and I see new, new energies coming in. I see you breaking away from the past. I also see that um, at times you are a little blind to what's going on in the situation. Spirit is saying to listen to your intuition, okay? Listen, when you, when you feel like you can't see or you can't figure something out, listen to your intuition, that gut feeling, because your intuition will guide you in the right direction. I also see a party. I see you in um, a party having fun. You are very talented, Gemini. Spirit is saying to work on your craft, focus on your talent. You are going to make money with this i see there's a little worry about money don't worry about making mistakes don't worry about you know falling when it comes to creating or you know um following your dreams know that it takes time and it doesn't matter how many times you fall it's all about how you get back up you know you are very talented and spirit is saying that you can make some serious cash with your talent so make sure you're investing in that also what i'm getting here is that your person is wearing a mask, okay? So be very careful with them. Spirit is saying to let them hang, okay? Yeah, let them hang there. Let them be. Distance yourself from them. Because what I see is that they want to swindle you. This could be swindle you out of money, love, sex, you know, some sort of benefit. So let them hang all right, let them be. Distance yourself is what spirit is saying. They're about to get a big wake up call. Yes, they are, Gemini. Don't worry. Karma ain't gonna miss. Karma is definitely going to knock on their door. All right, I see that your person is gonna reach out to you. They're gonna shoot their shot. I see you really happy about that. <laughs> I also see that um spirit is saying to watch your diet, make sure you eat healthier. I see you hesitant to leave. Like, I don't know, should I stay? Should I go? I don't know. You are transforming, Gemini. Transformations are not easy. Okay. Becoming a butterfly, going from a caterpillar to a butterfly doesn't happen overnight. It takes time. So know that the more you spend time alone with yourself and you heal and ground yourself, you meditate. Um, this is going to help you to transform and release the old and embrace the new. Spirit is saying to write down on a piece of paper all the things that you want to release out of your world. Um, anything. It could be people, situations, energies, whatever it is you want to release. Write it down on a piece of paper and burn it during a new moon or a full moon. Okay? Mm hmm. I see. A, I see talks about a house. All right. So there's going to be talks about a house. This could be relocating, moving in or moving out. OK. I also see you going on a date. I see you very happy going on a date. And I also see that um, Spirit is saying you will benefit by working out. So it's not all about looking good. It's also about stamina. So Spirit is saying work out. This will help with your energy. This will help with your stamina, not just looking good. And on top of that, you will be looking good. Okay, bless. <laughs> all right, Gemini. So think of that question you want to ask Spirit real quick. Spirit, what is the answer for Gemini? Thank you so much. Bless. All right. So, yeah, like I was saying, Gemini, the vibe, it ain't ending here. Mm -mm. We're going to go to the extended where we're going to talk about this new path opening up and the clarity that's coming in because truths are going to be revealed. And this truth is going to give you the clarity you need to make a decision. I do see that. I'm also going to do messages from your person. We're going to get a whole lot of messages from your person. And we're also going to do advice and guidance from the universe. So this is going to be general advice. So this is not just about love. So the advice may be about finances, your dreams, your love life, family. It could be anything, honestly. Um, and we're going to do that after the messages. So if you want to join me, let's get it. Let's go. That link is down below. I am here for you, baby. We're going to play Dilemma as I shuffle and lay out the cards. Bless. All right, so let's see, Spirit, what's the answer for Gemini? Thank you so much. Let's see. Gemini, Spirit is saying to watch your back. I don't know if um you're suspicious about friendship or something right now, but definitely watch your back, okay? Keep your antennas up. Be guarded. Spirit said maybe, okay? So it's not a yes, it's not a no, it's a maybe. All right, so you got to go with your intuition on this one, boo-boo. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Bless. All right, Gemini, listen. 
I'm going to go off to the extended now. I hope to see you there. But if this is where we're parting ways, I just want to say bless. I love you, Gemini. Listen, you deserve nothing but the best. Your person feels like you're the right person. It's just the wrong time for them. They feel like they're not ready for commitment and they have their own circumstances that they have to deal with where it will make it difficult to even commit here with you, Gemini. So do what you need to do for self, okay? Focus on yourself like the universe said and make sure you are honoring yourself, Gemini. You deserve the world. You are amazing. You are beautiful. You are great, okay? Yes. Guys, if this resonated with you, please give it a thumbs up. I appreciate that. Yes, thank you so much. And for anyone here that's new, welcome to the family, boo-boo. How you doing? I hope you're enjoying yourself here. Yes. And if you like it here, stay. Subscribe. Hit that bell button. Let's get it let's go all right i think it's down below to subscribe and hit the bell button not only do you get readings not only are you part of my family here on youtube but on top of that you get to be part of my weekly raffle yes every week i choose one random subscriber and i bless them with a box full of goodies and i'm not called baby oprah for no reason i am generous okay yes <laughs> all right so all you have to do is subscribe comment down below i choose my winners randomly through the comments at the end of the week and then i post that in the beginning of the week so that you can see who's the winner on my community board so always check out the community board to see if your name was listed good luck guys bless my ogs you already know what time it is i love you guys so much and i'm sending everyone love light and everything nice Mwah. i'll catch you in the next one gemini deuces bless